Welcome back folks, this is Agro Slay, the Black Mage, and we're back with Sinmar Civilization Beyond Earth. What was up with that sound? Well, whatever it was, it was a little creepy. So, we started the game last time, which we didn't get really far into it, nine turns. But, two civilizations have shown up. Central, which is honestly a little too close for my liking. And... Karabost, which is far enough away, I don't mind. So, let's be honest. If this ends up being a... Strange graphical error happened there. If this ends up being a game of domination, I can see Central being my main enemy. So that stated, we got some alien forces around us. And we're trying to get our explorer to the derelict settlement. Now, let's see, choose production. So hopefully you guys are having a good day. Now, I guess we need a worker so we can start improving our tiles around here and improve uh, the city's growth. Seriously, what is up with that sound every once in a while? Oh, quest decision. Since opening our clinic, the populace has been split by an ideological divide. Securing and improving our new territory has put great strain on both our military and civil workforce. Both contend that the hazards that they face should be offset by state-sponsored healthcare. Our fledgling colony does not have the resources to do both, which then has the greatest need of aid. So we can either provide care for defense workers, which is plus 15 city hit points from clinics, or plus 1 health from clinics for provide care for civil workers. The better healthcare we have, the better our nation does, or our civilization, so let's go with provide care for civil workers. And what unit needs orders? I'm going to just have my marines start moving backwards and uh, keep securing... Your explorer has noticed something strange nearby. It could be a ruin, some sort of wreckage, or perhaps... Thank you, we know that. Alright, and let's start on the next turn. Ah, uh, that's not good. Uh, you just fortify, so what's going to happen is he's going to sit here for a bit, and he's going to have a higher defense. So if they decide to attack him, he'll be able to handle the attack a lot better. Oh, let's check something. Uh, management, management, how are we looking? Uh, we could buy that. Let's purchase this. Alright, so now we are improving our growth and some production as well. And... Oh, return the map. Okay, so the aliens backed off, which is good. I'll give them a bit of a wide berth. And we got to develop a virtue. So, so far we've done some knowledge in industry. And we might have to start looking at might and prosperity. Ooh, field research. Let's take that. Okay. Just stay away from the settlement and we're good. Alright. Instruct the children not to dream of toys or sweets. Instruct them to dream of infrastructure. That doesn't make sense. Alright, so engineering allows the thermium reactor and repair facility buildings. Allow the combat rover military unit reveals titanium. So it's good to, that we can see another resource. And marines will stay near... Fortify, in case these guys become hostile for some odd reason. Alright. Uh, both the tech web and... Oh, hey! Our advisors are back. So they, these little symbols here, they tell us which advisor advises what. So military advises ecology, science, genetics, economic for planetary survey, 
And I know there's one other. Oh, where's the other? There's at least four. I don't see it. But there is a quest to get the pioneering done. So let's start doing pioneering to get that quest out of the way. And let's continue on with the next turn. So hopefully from here on out, it should get a little fast. Uh, crud. Mandira. The temple doors of the Protectorate are open. I feel like our audio got cut a little short. Alright, so let's start the expedition here. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's up there? Okay, so so far the aliens aren't doing a thing. And I don't really want to provoke them. But my troops do need some experience. But from... What I did hear about early concept when it came to this game, the way you react with the aliens, even in early game, can affect how they react to you late game. So let's not mess with them. Okay, so far staying quiet. Okay, so we got a worker. This allows us to do improvements of our situation. And we grew, so let's take a look at possible growths. Um, honestly, you're in a pretty good spot, so you'll stay. Now there should be an... Ah, here we go. Automate improvements. So the worker will just automatically go to tiles that need improvements, and based on what's assessed to be needed, it'll do that. Generally, for the first few games that I play, it'll do. I want to do this until I can learn all the stuff that needs to be learned. Okay, now it says we need a production. Um, let's take a. No, uh, turn the map. Where's the quest thing? Quest, quest, quest. Uh, you know, if no, I did not want to bring that up. Where's the quest? Diplomacy, virtues, covert ops, upgrade units. Oh, quest of victories. Here we go. Research pioneering. We're doing that. Five three resource pods. We're working on that. Xeno sanctuary. So how do we build a Xeno sanctuary? No, uh, it doesn't really say. So let's start building a repair facility. Give plus 10% production on land units. I'm not liking those aliens, but so far they haven't attacked us. We haven't attacked them. So it's all good. Expedition completed. Uh, refugees free to sell in your city of Mogan, raising its population by one. And we've got pioneering. Come, Mr. Haban. The Commonwealth welcomes you. Okay, we got another group. The universe is either in progress or in entropy. We choose progress. Allows trade depot buildings, allows the colonists, trade convoy, and trade vessels. So where did this Commonwealth settle? Ah, here we go. So, so far, everyone's staying pretty far away except the central people, which, sadly, we will have to deal with in due time. So, my unit needs to go back. Uh, I'll just have my military follow, allow the aliens to come this way. Uh, you'll just stay there. Quest updates. Build one colonist unit. Alright. Uh, 
I actually like this whole quest thing. It gives you a lot more purpose to do than simply say, what am I supposed to do? Um... Let's see, I got one saying planetary survey, another saying ecology. Um, ooh, computing might be good. I'm trying to figure out where's this. Alien, uh... Uh... What's it called? Uh, the one that allowed... The Zeno thing. Ooh, robotics might be nice. Uh... Okay, well, let's see. I got one who's saying planetary survey, one saying ecology, one saying genetics. And that's it. Um if we got a guy saying genetics, then let's take one in genetics. Okay, just like I expected. Aliens are leaving. What I might end up doing is taking a settlement down here as well. Because it actually be pretty well defended from the mountains. Well, let's just keep our explorer covered. Ooh, develop a virtue again. Ooh, we can improve our culture. Plus one energy from every basic resource. Hmm. Let's improve our culture. Alright, and let's have our expedition team go out this way. And Marines will go there. Oh, we got a quest update. Uh, station charter. Choose a, choose a station to charter. Several new ventures wish to establish their operations in our territory. They provide different services that may be useful. Stet Mining provides four production to any city that establishes a trade route. Shack Dip provides one culture and one production to science to any city that establishes. Which venture would you like to approve? Well, how do I approve? Uh, let's see, pull quests. Build a colonist. We need a colonist now. Uh, where's our colonist? Oh, there you go. Eleven turns. Ouch. That's going to take a while, but... Uh, let's go with Shackleton. You have discovered a station. You can establish trade routes with stations to receive various... Um, excuse me, why are you there? Who, who's Shackled? Well, I guess I'm not going that way now. Oh, crit. There we go.
Alright, I guess we just need to go another turn. You go to war with the soldiers you have. Make sure those are the soldiers you want. Allows the kitchen, nursery, and pharma labs. Alright. Well, that sucks. I wanted that place. Okay, new research. Uh, one thing, chemistry. One thing, planetary survey. One still saying ecology. Wait, wait. Okay, there is four. Where's the fourth one? Looks like a diamond. I don't know. Alien life forms allow the alien preserve. Oh, hey! That's what we're looking for. Alien preserve. Oh, alien scientists. That's what we were looking for. Ooh, but I might speed up with ecology, so let's go for that. I guess what we need to do is see what Central's been up to. Wait, that was Miasma? Dang. Oh, pod. I normally don't say this kind of stuff, but mine. That's mine. Okay. Don't bother the natives. Don't bother the natives. Um, holy crap, that's a manticore, alright, really do not, do not bother the natives at all. Alright, we got a Meripod providing 40 energy. It looks like Central is starting to grow a bit. Station discovered. You have discovered Keegan. Keegan provides two culture and two science to AC that establishes a trade route. Only one city per colony may trade with each station at a time. Alright, so these little, uh, colored areas, this is their territory. Unless you are allowed to cross through it, you can't go in there unless you want to declare war. So... And we have player number six, Cadaladel. El pueblo unido de Sudamérica le da la bienvenida. Now, people of South America, bid you welcome. Okay. When Coyote learned he was the only one of his kind on the new planet, his howl echoed through the rifts and off the distant hills. Okay. Oh, we got a quest update. Kill one siege worm. Okay. Oh gosh, that is so cool. Alright, so... Let's see, where's the... Oh, here we go. Alien Sciences. Okay, there's the diamond. There's the science. There's the culture. The red one's not that hard to miss.
Okay, I guess they don't always all show, you know, what they want. Chemistry, recycler, laboratory. I guess we'll start going over chemistry next. Because this alien sciences will take way too long. Jeez, this world's starting to get a little smaller. Hey there! You're getting a little close to my territory. You can You can found an outpost with your colonist. Outposts eventually grow into cities. An outpost will prosper when founded in a location with plentiful food. So choose a location with food producing resources or grassland if possible. Move your colonist to a fertile location and found an outpost. Alright. So these must be good ideas for outposts. Now I don't like crossing the river, so I don't think I'll choose there. I might choose here then. Or here. Uh, I guess I'll have my colonists go there. Oh, uh, now we need to choose production. Uh, let's do the trade depot to allow more trade routes. And let's produce more science. What's ours is yours. It's hard to find good for a price. It is hard to find good neighbors on this planet. I like to establish a corporation agreement for the betterment of both our people. What do you say? Yes, let's work together. Why am I still taking damage from the Miasma? Oh, do not want to start a fight there. So I can... Yeah, I definitely see me potentially going to war. What's ours is yours. Okay. For a price. Their offer is they want open borders. Your offer... Is open borders. They have a lot more energy. Yeah, let's just accept it for now. You discover Red Sun. Red Sun provides more energy to any city that establishes a trade route. Dang it, where are these colonies keep popping up from? And I think we're starting to find the size of this island. And we got a quest update. Alright, what is it? For your eyes only. Research computing. From an unknown origin, after considerable effort has been decoded, the clear text reads, The Culper Cell requires infrastructure for covert operations. Should you choose to accept, you'll be rewarded time. Research computing. Alright. And let's build our first outpost. We received a soldier. So let's see anything else. Not really much we can do. No, oh, one of the opponents are getting stronger. Excuse me, I have important information for you. A four billion year old worth of resources shared among a handful of people are gonna make a fortune here. Allows the laboratory a recycler. 
allows workers to build a petroleum well tower per whip fields petroleum. Alright, uh, that's all the time we have for today. So hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Arrow Slay, the Black Mage, and I'll see you guys around the bend. <laughs>